Hey, I'm Jose. I'm here with Sam at his place. We're going to install the Yak Attack 8 inch gear track along with the Yak Attack Panfish uh, Portrait Dog Bone Combo. Okay, so, first of all, we're going to be installing this Yak Attack gear track. This is an 8 inch gear track. And what we're going to use in this case is self tapping screws to secure the gear track onto the body of the kayak. Normally, you'd want to use bolts, but in this case, in this install, because of the location, we won't be able to access the back. So we'll use self-tapping screws instead. And because it has many holes throughout the, the, the track itself, it should hold on with, without a problem. What we'll be installing on here is this panfish dog bone combo. And this panfish dog bone combo is going to be very nice for taking video. Um, what I really like about it is it's extremely adjustable. With the conventional uh, setups right now for video, you don't have a whole lot of uh, say in how you're going to frame the shot. Um, of your kayak. So with this you can get the shot you want every time the way you want it without any boundaries. The other thing I like about it is that not just for using it above the water but you could also bend this down and put this below the water level and have a under the water shot of you landing a fish or, or whatever is uh, by the kayak. So it's extremely versatile. So the first thing we're going to do when installing this gear track is figure out the location to, to install it in. Um, this area right here looks great. It's uh, the curved surface of the kayak kind of works with the curved surface of the gear track. So it can be installed here without a problem. Um, this location will be really good for setting up the behind the shoulder shot and even if you want it underwater, it will work for both. So I think we're going to install it here. It's going to look sleek and, and clean and, and it'll be very practical. All right, so I'm here with the panfish dog bone combo. I'm gonna throw it on the gear track we just installed. It's pretty easy to put on. All you have to do is line up the thread with the slot of the gear track, and then you just tighten it down to where it locks. And if I wanted to slide this into place, I can move it into any position I want. And then I tighten it, and it's locked down. And with these adjustments from the ram ball, I can position this camera mount in any position I want to and it's super versatile, I love it. So whether you wanted to use it above the water or even if you wanted to get a shot under the water, aiming a little bit more at uh, your subject, you could do whatever you want with this. All right, so now everything's set up. It's uh, angled the way I want it. Um, now all this is a quarter inch thread. All you have to do is attach your uh, camera, whether it's a GoPro or Oregon Scientific or Contour, whichever camera you use, um, you just throw it on here and you're pretty much ready to go. All right, so everything's set up and ready to go. One of the other cool things about the uh, panfish uh, dog bone combo is that um, if you're sitting on the kayak and you wanted to pan the video to see what's going on there, because it's on two separate axes, you could actually just turn this and pan. And this way you could capture whatever's going on in the side. And if you need to go back to uh, the over the shoulder shot, you got it.